In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the splitting function in Tableau Prep, which if you've ever used Excel, it's known as text to columns. And I'm going to show you how to do text to rows also in Tableau Prep. So before we begin, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because I release new Tableau videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Let's head over to Tableau. All right, we've got our trusty little data set here. So you can download this in the description below if you want to follow along. Let's drag and drop. And there's only one field we're interested for this uh, interested in for this example is uh, product. All right, so let's hit clean step. And we can see all the product fields here. And what I want to do is I want to do a text to column or a splitting as it's known in Tableau prep. And what I want to do, let me get my drawing tool out, is I want to split them using the comma, right? So every time there's a comma, I want to to be in another column. So comma, 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 right, none there, and so on and so forth. And it's really easy to do in Tableau Prep. All we do is right click here, go split values, and we can either do automatic splitting, which is Tableau will just read and try and find the delimiter. Uh, the delimiter could be anything, a comma, a space, a dash, a hyphen. Uh, slash or whatever it might be, but I tend to use the custom split because then I can explicitly say it's a comma, right? So we use the separator or delimiter, right? As some people know it, and we can control how many fields it will generate because sometimes you may have three commas in there, but you're only interested in that first field. So to reduce you having to or to prevent you from having to create heaps of data, you can say just give me the first data split, right? Or maybe you want two or three. Right. For this example, we're going to set this to all. Right. We want everything that gets split out. And you'll see it's going to create a number of fields, which means if we have six um, fields maximum, that means there's one in here with five commas in it. Right. And that is how you would do your basic splitting. But I also talked about how you would do text to rows. Right. So we're going to combine this with the pivot function. And if you've never done pivot before, I have a, uh, a video on how to do that, two of them, how to pivot and unpivot. For this case, we'll be using the unpivoting function. And before we do that, though, we're going to get rid of this product field. So what happens in splitting is it always preserves the original data, right? Unlike Excel, where it will just split it, this one, it actually keeps the original one in case you need to use it, which I do a lot. Um, for this particular case, we don't need it. So we're going to right click and remove. So we end up with just the splitting right there. You can probably hear that dog barking. All right, uh, let's head to pivot, right? And what we're going to do is we're gonna convert from columns to rows. So we just leave that as is. And let's bring all of these in here, like so. And we go clean step. We can get rid of this label now. And you can see it's actually converted it from um, text to columns to now text to rows. So you got to do it in two steps, like so, All right? That's it. So if you like this video, drop me a like. It helps me with the YouTube algorithm a lot. So please hit that and smash that if you can. Um, be sure to uh, be sure to subscribe because I release new Tableau videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And until then, have a great day and bye.